she came out here and f attacked me, dude. I don't hit females. Whatever you guys, he needs to go to jail. He needs to sit in jail. He just hit me. And he just hit me right here. The title of this video is How Little Kid Saved Dad from Arrest, Exposed Girlfriend's Lies and Abuse. Listen, some good coffee and a happy ending. Drink the coffee, it'll make you feel better. And then he needs to get out of here. What, explain to me what's going on prior so, to this. Hold on, hold on, hold on, one second. I will talk to you in a second. Do you understand? I'm talking to her first. Listen to me. Go inside, I will talk to you in a second. Do you understand? Do you understand? Go inside, I will talk to you in a second. You're going in handcuffs. All right, go inside. I came up here, we started arguing, he had hit me. And I told him, I said, it's the last time you're going to hit me. And I'm just done with it. He needs to get the f*** out of here. Where did he hit you at? Right here. He hit me, he just hit me, and I fell right there. Did you hit him first? No, I hit him, put my hands on him. Okay, what caused this whole argument? Honestly, I don't really even know. Because he had left in the vehicle, that's what caused it. He you guys had kids, kids together? Up. Yeah. Okay. He was trying to start a fight between somebody else. And I wasn't. Be careful who you choose to have kids with. I'm not getting in a fight. Show me with your hand. Like, what did he do? Like, I went to grab his phone and he, like, hit me. Like, he went like this and I fell right here. And nobody yeah. was out here to see it, but he hit me. It was right here. He didn't yeah. hit me, like, but it was, he hit me. Yeah. Have you guys been drinking tonight? No, at all? I haven't drank anything. Has he been drinking? He's been drinking. Okay. You want to come out and talk <laughs> to me now? She's just perfect. <laughs> <laughs> ah man. Hey, hey, my son's right here. Come out and talk to me now. Listen, you gotta calm down. Come down here so I can talk to you. Dad, dude, this is crazy. The proof of the story is I've been trying to get that out of my house for months. She will not leave. This is my dad that that tries to, you know, mediate things. And this, I pay all the bills. She's not on the lease. I've been begging her to leave. My son right there was watching out the window while I was trying to get in my home. She came out here and f attacked me, dude. I don't hit females. I'm sorry how angry I Where am. Where did she attack you? Though? In the back of my head. This man is traumatized and stressed. You can hear it. Right. Oh, here. God. Wait, thanks. Like, this isn't the first time either. And then okay. what happened after as she As soon as out? I got out, she come rushing up at me. We, you know, we have two girls. Mm -hmm. This ain't the first time cops has been here for me and her. I mean, not like just arguing and shit, but like she fighting his neighbor, his old lady, and then she comes at me and hits me. My son's sitting in that. No, that's why I'm mad because the man and I'm trying to get her out of my house and Overlook ain't wanting to do nothing. Well, you got to properly evict her. While my son was sitting there watching it. So how, how did her chin get all red right here? Her chin got red. Yeah, like her jaw right here. Hey, she slipped right here. I do ask them, ask my son. I don't, didn't hit her. Did not. I would never hit her. Can you tell us what happened, buddy? So I was... Um, all right. Kid's here. He's going to tell the truth. Let's check it out. I on my phone and, uh, on the couch, and then I heard Brittany on the phone... Um, yelling at my dad to get oh. home and then go, no go back inside real quick we're talking to everybody separately you're talking to a child yeah i am go back inside it's at this moment she realized she was screwed this coffee's criminal <gasps> this coffee is criminal please go back inside what the f and yelling and then she came out of the door and then I heard them screaming and I looked out the window and then I heard and then I seen Brittany hit a punch and my dad like blocked it like that and then she kind of my dad kind of like I like kind of pushed her off a little bit and then that was it and then my dad came in yelling and was saying uh he, he was gonna call the police and Brittany kept going saying she was gonna call the police he wants to press charges wait, wait, wait. on me Listen, listen, officer, listen. Listen to this. I did not put my hands on Ooh, it's time for that coffee, lady. The coffee. It'll make it's you time better. for that coffee. Him. He hit me. Is there any way that he can just go? My kids are asleep. You and can go to jail. Driving my vehicle. But it's your guys' kids together, right? Yeah, it's our kids together. But he, but he was trying to start an argument between me and somebody else, and then he had hit me. 
he hit me in my face. That's how he will try to make it to be like I'm lying, but I'm not lying. There's a mark on my face. Well, right here, it's it's like oh. she's been in the house in the bathroom, looking in the mirror, bopping herself in the face. <laughs> There's nothing funny about this. I don't know if it's because you're rubbing it or what. No, he had hit me. Yeah, hit him in the back of the no, head. No, I did not do any of that shit. And that, I didn't hit Is him. that your son out there? No, that's my stepson. That's his son. I mean, do you think, like... Ah, she's like... <laughs> she's like, that little traitor's not mine. Uh, how old is your stepson? He's 11. Do you think an 11-year-old would just kind of make up and fabricate a story, or...? Honestly, I, I really do. I really think so. This is the last time he's going to put his hands on me because I've been hit enough. Me and my kids have been through enough here. Whatever you guys, he needs to go to jail. He needs to sit in jail and ha he needs to have some time to think about what the f is doing because he's acting f crazy. He had hit me and it's the last time he's going to put his hands on me so, ever again. So you, after you went out there to the car and confronted him for whatever reason, you're saying he just hit you? Yeah, why did you go outside and confront him? So he showed up at the house. You're inside, correct? He had came back. because he. Come on, Brittany, answer the questions. He was leaving. So he left the house, came back. You're inside, he's outside. Right. You went outside to talk to him? Right, I went outside to talk to him. I'm just very overwhelmed right now, as you can imagine. You know what I mean? I just don't, I just don't know what to do. The Amber Heard tears. So in this next part, this lying girlfriend who's trying to falsely accuse her boyfriend starts telling the cops that she wants to press charges. Charges against him, actually. I think that, I think that is what When it comes to it, it doesn't even matter if you want to or not want to. Really? Nope. Doesn't matter. Once the primary aggressor is determined. I have my kids in there. Like, I mean, he shouldn't have hit me. You know what I mean? And he... Well, I'm sure his story is the same, saying that you shouldn't have hit him. Right, but and, you know, I didn't and, hit him. But, well, I mean, and, and he didn't hit you, apparently. Once you get done with your statement. Get done with your statement. You're going to jail. So Ooh, here we go. Let's go. I'm going to jail. Yes. You're under arrest. How, no, no, no. How am I under arrest? Because you're determined you're to be the primary arrest. aggressor. I'm under. No, no, no. No, 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 no. Uh, how am I under arrest? No, 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 no. How am I under arrest? Stop. Okay. I just. Hey, hey, you guys. Stop. No, you're no, no, make no. This no, worse. no, no, no. You're going to no, get a resisting no, charge. No, no. Get in there. No, no. Need more coffee. No, no. Sit. How are you doing this to me, Ray? No, no. No, no, no. How Put are... your foot in. How are you? Woo. Ah. Yeah. I should get some comments here. This top comment says, her cries make my soul smile. I understand. Somebody else here added, this was the most satisfying video I've seen in years. <laughs> This guy's you know, the amount of false allegations that men have dealt with either in marriages, relationships, is crazy. You don't usually get to see these types of chicks get brought to justice. This is honestly beautiful to see. I'm sorry. I don't care how you feel about it. Another person here says, finally, a quiet night alone. LOL. Just for about another commenter that says the bear hitting return to sender. That's funny. Here's somebody else who added, this is rare. Of course, he's talking about like seeing a woman face accountability in this type of situation. Somebody else here added, love this for her. Sort by another comment that says, I'm loving this for her. Another woman there said that. Somebody else here says she was quick to try to send him to jail with the exclamation mark. Somebody else here says, no, 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 no. And the laughing emojis followed by the final comment, being in this situation, this warms my heart. Yeah, crazy stuff. Of course, I'm curious to know, what do you guys think? Leave your comments down below. Till next time, I'm out. Peace.